Prime Minister Shabazz Sharif said he had expressed his government's resolve to complete the terms of the IMF program in a conversation with the lender's managing director yesterday. The telephone conversation comes as Pakistan's economy is increasingly febrile, with foreign exchange reserves amounting to fewer than three weeks of imports. The Premier's statement comes a day after he said an IMF delegation would come to Pakistan in two to three days to finalize the ninth review of Pakistan's $7 billion extended fund facility. The country is currently in the midst of a severe cash crunch, with foreign exchange reserves in the State Bank of Pakistan's depleting to an eight-year low of $5.576 billion during the week ending on 30th December 2022. This decline left no space for the government to pay back its foreign debts without borrowing more from friendly countries. PTI leader Fawad Chaudhry has claimed that some army generals as well as ex-army chief General Retired Kamar Javed Bajwa were actively involved in sending the PTI government home. The former information minister made the claim during a BBC Hard Talk interview. Fawad went on to claim that the establishment was also controlling the parties allied with the PTI in the previous government. He dismissed the notion that the PTI was against the military, saying his party was not against anyone. When asked about what evidence there was to back up Khan's claims about being removed through a foreign conspiracy, Fawad Chaudhry said his party presented the evidence, the cipher, about the United States' alleged involvement in the ouster of the PTI government in key meetings, but they were not paid heed to. He, however, said that the PTI did not want confrontational relations with the US. He added that no one should interfere in Pakistan's governance matters. Former Prime Minister Shahid Khaqan Abbasi termed the Amendment to the Army Act 1952 in January 2020 a mistake that needed to be repealed. When the extension was given to the force of the Sarbara, the force was accepted, it was then changed to change it. And this was the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court said that the Parliament will decide on this. So, to change this decision, it was not in the force of the force or in the force of the force. लेकिन जो गलती हुई वो जो जो कानून में तरमीन की गई जिससे एक्सटेंशन जो गैर मामूली अमल है उसकी मामूली अमल बना दिया गया कानून का हिस्सा बना दिया गया It is pertinent here to note that this act granted former Chief of Army Staff General Retired Kamar Javed Bajwa a three-year extension. The former Prime Minister claimed that the decision should have been made in November 2019, but Imran rushed to make that decision. He claimed that the army's institution itself would call for it to be repealed. The Punjab Counterterrorism Department arrested five alleged terrorists during 21 intelligence-based operations in various districts of the province, according to a CTD spokesperson. The alleged terrorists arrested after interrogating 22 suspects were identified as Inamul Haq, Maskinullah, Wahid Khan, Sher Naqib, and Shah Wali. The spokesperson added that they belong to various banned religious organizations, including the banned militant group Tariq-e-Taliban Pakistan. 